Hello friends, this is your Yoga Nandam, Biology Lecture from Medal Academy YouTube channel. In this video, we will discuss about sexual reproduction in flowering plants. We will discuss 50 questions on the discuss in the form of quiz. We are going to discuss one by one. This is a neat exam to prepare for students. This is a full exam to ready for students. This is useful. You will expect the objective questions. Expect so, we will discuss the first question. All flowering plants show which mode of reproduction? Tell me the answer. Flowering plants, like any type of reproduction, asexual reproduction, vegetative reproduction, or pathocarpic type of reproduction, any type of reproduction. All flowering plants. Flowering plants, so mostly sexual reproduction. Flowering plants, like any type of reproduction, sexual Reproduction, reproduction down the Rima Rakadi. So the answer is none of the above. The next parne. Next question parne. Which of the following is an end product of sexual reproduction? Sexual reproduction or end product in a flowers are megaspora, fruits and seeds are none of the above. Sexual reproduction or end products in a ring patina condi fruits and seeds after pollination, fertilization. Ovary dollars into fruit, ovary dollars into seed. So, flowering plants like sexual reproduction or end product in the fruits and the seeds. Sorry. Answer check. Next question. Question number three. Flower are objects of flowers in the object, aesthetic value, ornamental and social value, religious and cultural value. Are all of these. Answer is all of these. Flower, flower are objective, objects of aesthetic value or ornamental love, ornamental purpose, social value, religious and cultural value or so in the question cancer and then what option D. Next question number four. Site of sexual reproduction in plants is sexual reproduction. Any narakade in parne sexual reproduction, internodal region, la fruits, la floral buds, la leaflets so ungalku therinjadha idu sexual reproduction enga nadakkudhu flower la dhaan nadakkudhu floral buds so the answer is option c question number 5 parunga inflorescence bears the what do you know about inflorescence inflorescence na ve ungalku theriyum seeds ah kedaiyadhu fruits ah kedaiyadhu okay floral buds floral buds ah leaflets ah so inflorescence Inflorescence bears in the part of the floral buds. Collection of that is, you know, group of flowers together form inflorescence. Floral bud, single flower also belongs to cymos type of inflorescence. That is solitary, single flower in a type of inflorescence, cymos type of inflorescence. So floral buds together form that is, floral buds together form inflorescence. So option C. Next question number six for Andresium. What do you know about Andresium? Male part of the flower, female part of the flower. So this one is easily understanding question. Try to remember is male reproductive part of the uh, flower of being sold on number. Sorry. But if the flower contain either male or female reproductive part of being on the unisexual, unisexual plant and soloma, unisexual flower and soloma. Pistil matter is the female flower of Dean Both Andesium and Gynesium are the bisexual flower of Dean Sundar. So, this is the answer match. So, this is the answer of none of these. Andesium is the male reproductive part of the flower. Next, question number seven. Female reproductive structure in your flower is known as the female reproductive part in your flower. Female reproductive part on the gynesium or pistol or monoecious. What is monoecious and diocious? Try to understand. Male and female flowers are present in the same plant. Na the monoecious or nectariferous gland. I mean, like the honey secreting glands, milk secreting glands. That's all nectariferous gland. I mean, so on. And it's the male reproductive part. So, this is the answer. Is that option D? None of these. Next question for me. Question number eight. Stamens are part of 
Stamens are part of gynoecium, andresium, megasporangium, fruit. Stamens are part of andresium. Stamens are male reproductive part of andresium. So, question number 8 is B. Question number 9. Stock of stamen, stamen is known as. So, like stock of the stamen is known as number. Funical. Stock of ovule. Hylum. Scar. Filament. Stock of. Stock of stamen. Filament. Of so, this is the answer. Option C. Question number 10. Anthra is part of. Anthra is a part of gynecema, ovula, stamen, megasporangema. Stamen, stamen consists of anther and filament. Apo, anther is the part, stamen is part, male reproductive part. So, option C is the correct answer. Question number 11. Parunge. Which part of the stamen is attached to the thalamus or petal? Pollen grain, the proximal end of the anthera, distal end of the stamen filamenta, proximal end of stamen filamenta. In the part that I check, I will proximal end of stamen filament. Thalamus is the floral axis. All the floral parts are attached to the part and the part is called thalamus. So, this is the proximal end of stamen filament attached to thalamus. So, this is the correct option. D. Then question number 12. Which of the following is correct? The number of stamen is variable in flowers of different species. Yes, it is the correct number of stamen variable in flowers of different species. Ella flowers the number of stamen same or similar are Sorry, A correct. Second one, parge. the length of stamen is constant in flowers of different species. Length of stamen is similar arkma. No, is wrong. B wrong. C parge. the distal end of the filament of stamen is attached to thalamus of uh, or petal of flower. Just now we have discussed 11th question of whether discuss one. Distal end of proximal end on solid. So this is wrong. C. The next parge. Anther and funicle are two parts of stamen. Anther and funicle. Funicle is the ovule part. Stock of the ovule funicle. But D is wrong. So, this is the correct one. A. Correct one. Question number 13. Question number 13. Microsporangia are located in. Microsporangia is located in. Ovule, ovule, anther, thalamus. In the part, Microsporangium, microspores, abdinave on the male gametes are produced for the spores. Microspores are always called as male reproductive spores. And microsporangia on the other anther, dithicus, monothicus, abdina anther lobes are dithicus anther the common type. The dithicus anther on the four microsporangium are called the microsporangium puller, microspore. Mother cells here come. So, the answer is option C. First number 14. A bilobed anther contains. Bilobed anther, just now I said, bilobed anther, four microsporangia is bilobed with two lobes, dithicus, monothicus with two microsporangia. So clear understand me. Bilobed anther. Bilobed anther with four microsporangia. Answer D. Question number 15. Microsporangia further develops into. Microsporangia further in our develop the embryo sac, anther, pollen sacs, none of these. Embryo sac is the female gametophyte. Anther. Anther is the microsporangia on the develop. Pollen sacs. Pollen sacs are not developed. The microsporangia further in our developed. Pollen sacs. Microspore mother cells from Yasi cell division under the pollen grains form of the pollen grains are stored when you can on the pollen sacs. So, you can answer is option C. Question number 16. Dithicus anther. Dithicus abdinavum lecterium. 
okay that uh, anther with two lobes two theca in each anther lobe is called as dithecus idu ovule kedaiyadu thalamus kedaiyadu so the anther la irukra lobes two lobes da vandu namba dithecus appdi solrom so idhukku correct answer edhu pathina ku vandu 16th one next one parunga 17th one pollen sacs represent at the end at the pollen sacs are present pollen sacs enga irukke present at the which part abdin getting abdin ak vandu so extend longitudinally through the entire length of anther pollen sacs enga irukke anther ku la irukke entire length of anther so idhu cancer option d question number 18 parunga microsporangium has how many outer wall layers மைக்ரோஸ்பொராஞ்சியம் அப்படின்னாவே உங்களுக்கு தெரியும் மேல் கேமிட்டோபைட்டா ஃபீமேல் கேமிட்டோபைட்டா அப்படின்னு கிளியர் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் பண்ணிங்க மேல் கேமிட்டோபைட் இப்போ நம்ம ஆந்தரை கிராஸ் செக்ஷன் எடுத்து பார்த்தோம் அப்படின்னாக்க வந்து அதில் ஃபோர் லேயர்ஸ் இருக்கும் என்னென்ன ஃபோர் லேயர்ஸ் இருக்கு அப்படின்னு பார்த்தீங்கன்னா வந்து ஓட்டர் எபிடர்மீஸ் அண்ட் மிடில் லேயர் என்டோதீசியம் அண்ட் டபிட்டம் ஸோ டோட்டலாக எத்தனை லேயர் இருக்கும் ஃபோர் லேயர்ஸ் இருக்கும் ஸோ அதனால வந்து இதுக்கு ஆன்சர் கரெக்ட் ஆன்சர் எதுன்னு பாருங்க கரெக்ட் ஆப்ஷன் சி ஃபோர் கொஸ்ட் நம்பர் நைன்டீன் தி இன்னர் மோஸ்ட் லேயர் ஆஃப் மைக்ரோஸ்பாஞ்சிம் இஸ் நோனஸ் ஃப்ரம் அவுட்டர் டு இன்னர் இன்னர் டு அவுட்டர் அப்படின்னு பார்த்தீங்க அப்படின்னாக்க வந்து இதில் வந்து அவுட்டர் த அவுட்டர் மோஸ்ட் லேயர் அப்படின்னு பார்த்தோம்னாக்க வந்து எபிடர்மிஸ் அப்படின்னு பார்த்தோம் எபிடர்மிஸ் என்டோதீசியம் சாரி எபிடர்மிஸ் மிடில் லேயர் எண்டோதீசியம் டபிட்டம் வரும் த இன்னர் மோஸ்ட் லேயர் வந்து டபிட்டம் டபிட்டம் ப்ரொவைட்ஸ் நொரிஷன் ஃபார் டெவலப்பிங் போலன் கிரெயின்ஸ் டபிட்டம் ப்ரொவைட் நியூட்ரிஷன் ஃபார் டெவலப்பிங் போலன் கிரெயின்ஸ் ஸோ இது இஸ் இன்னர் மோஸ்ட் லேயர் ஸோ ஆன்சர் டி தென் கொஸ்ட் நம்பர் டுவெண்ட்டி பாருங்க டுவெண்ட்டி விச் ஆஃப் த ஃபாலோயிங் கான்ஸ்டியூண்ட் விச் ஆஃப் த ஃபாலோயிங் கான்ஸ்டியூண்ட் தி வால் லேயர்ஸ் ஆஃப் மைக்ரோஸ்பொராஞ்சியம் என்னென்ன கான்ஸ்டியூட் பண்ணுது என்னென்ன வந்து வால் லேயர்ஸை கான்ஸ்டியூட் பண்ணுது என்டோதீசியம் சரி ஒன் ஆஃப் த வால் லேயர் இண்டோ கார்ப் கிடையாது என்டோ கார்ப் வந்து ஃப்ரூட்டில் இருக்கு தென் அவுட்டர் இன்டெக்மெண்ட் இன்னர் இன்டெக்மெண்ட் எபிடர்மிஸ் மிடில் லேயர்ஸ் எக்டோ கார்ப் டபிட்டம் ஸோ இதில் உங்களுக்கு கிளியராக தெரியும் வால் லேயர்ஸ் ஆஃப் மைக்ரோஸ்பிராஞ்சியம் அப்படின்னு எடுத்துக்கிட்டோம்னாக்க வந்து ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஒன் இஸ் என்ன இருக்கு பாருங்கள் ஏ இருக்கு என்டோதீசியம் இருக்கு The next one, the epidermis is A, the epidermis is A, the middle layer is A, the tapetum is A. So, the clear understand is A, the other layer is A, the other layer is A, none of these. A, E, F, H, A, E, F, H. So, the option is A, so the answer is A, the D. Then question number 21. Which wall layer of microsporangium helps in protection and decisions of anther to release pollen grain? In the wall layer, microsporangium will protect the anther. They will use anther to release pollen grain. The pollen grain will release the anther to use pollen grain. The outermost layer, the outer and inner layer, the outer two layer, the outer three layer. So, the answer is the answer. 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 அவுட்டர் த்ரீ லேயர்ஸ் தான் வந்து ப்ரொடக்டிவ் லேயர்ஸ் அப்படின்னு சொல்கிறோம் இந்த இன்னர் இன்னர் மோஸ்ட் லேயர் வந்து டபிட்டம்ல பார்த்தோம் அதாவது டோட்டலாக ஃபோர் லேயர்ஸ் இருக்குது ஃபோர் லேயர்ஸில் அந்த அவுட்டர் த்ரீ லேயர்ஸ் வந்து ப்ரொடக்டிவ் ஃபங்க்ஷன் இன்னர் லேயர் ப்ரொவைட் நொரிஷ்மெண்ட் ஃபார் டெவலப்பிங் பாலன் ரெயின்ஸ் அப்படின்னு பார்த்தோம் ஸோ இதுக்கு ஆன்சர் டி தென் கொஸ்ட் நம்பர் டுவெண்ட்டி டூ பாருங்கள் ஸ்டேட் த கரெக்ட் ஸ்டேட்மெண்ட் டபிட்டம் இஸ் த தேர்ட் லேயர் ஆஃப் மைக்ரோஸ்பர் அஞ்சியம் கொடுத்துருக்காங்க இல்லை டபிட்டம் இஸ் இன்னர் மோஸ்ட் ஃபோர்த் லேயர் ஸோ அப்போ டபிட்டம் அப்போ டபிட்டம் இந்த கரெக்ட் ஒன் ஆப்ஷன் ஏ இஸ் தட் இஸ் ராங் நெக்ஸ்ட் பி பாருங்கள் த அவுட்டர் த்ரீ வால் லேயர்ஸ் ஹெல்ப் இன் டெக்கிசன்ஸ் ஆஃப் ஆன்தர் டு ரிலீஸ் ஆஃப் போலன்னு கொடுத்துருக்காங்க ஸோ இது வந்து கரெக்ட் தான் அவுட்டர் த்ரீ வால் லேயர்ஸ் வந்து ப்ரொடெக்ஷன் ஆஸ் வெல் ஆஸ் வந்து டெல்ஸ் டு டெக்கிஸ் and release and uh, pollen grains then see for the cells of tapetum tapetum possesses dense cytoplasm so that is correct abdin pathina ka vandu yes see here correct 
then deeper uh, cells of epitome generally have more than one nucleus yes it is multi nucleus more than one nucleus okay so for which uh, which are the statements are correct have been passing like on the b c and d b c and d are correct so option c next sporogenous tissue is present in sporogenous tissue edhil irukke abdin pathina kavandu inga ovule ku illa illa embryo sac ku illa illa microsporangium ku illa irukke sporogenous tissue enga irukke microsporangium microsporangium the sporogenous tissue la irundha indha da vandu microspores form agudhu pollen grains form agudhu and goes meiosis cell division sporogenous tissue la irundhu மைக்ரோஸ்போர் மதர் செல்ஸ் ஃபார்ம் ஆகுது மைக்ரோஸ்போர் மதர் செல்ஸ் அண்ட் கோஸ் மியாசிஸ் அண்ட் டிவிஷன் ஆஸ் ரிசல்ட் போல் அண்ட் ட்ரெயின்ஸ் ஃபார்ம் ஆகுது ஸோ ஆப்ஷன் சி கரெக்ட் ஆன்சர் கஸ் நம்பர் டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபோர் பாருங்க ஸ்போரோஜினஸ் டிஷ்யூ ஆர் சொல்லுங்க ஸ்போரோஜினஸ் டிஷ்யூ என்ன லூஸ்லி அரேஞ்சா இல்லை காம்பேக்ட்லி அரேஞ்சா ஹோமோஜினஸ் டிஷ்யூவா இல்லை போத் பி அண்ட் சிஆர் ஸ்போரோஜினஸ் டிஷ்யூ வந்து காம்பேக்ட்லி அரேஞ்சு ஹோமோஜினஸ் டிஷ்யூ So, if you answer in a slow number, D, option D is correct, both B and C. Then, question number 25, parang, microspores are formed by, microspores are in the form of the tapetum, sporogenous, yes, microspores are in the form of the sporogenous tissue, in the form of the, the new cell is like the endothesium, so B, correct option on the LFB. Next, question number 26, parang, <coughs> How many microspores formed from single cell or sporogenous tissue? So, this is what you know. The end of meiosis cell division. Microspore mother cells are meiosis cell division. If you have meiosis cell division, how many cells form? Four form. So, single cell or sporogenous tissue produce how many microspores? Four microspores. So, correct option is C. Then, next question for me. Which type of cell division facilitates the formation of microspores from sporogenous tissue? Mitosis, meiosis, no cell division, just increase in size, fusion of two cells of sporogenous tissue. Are. Meiosis, which type of cell division takes place during the microspore formation from the sporogenous tissue? Meiosis cell division. option b then question number 28 parunga microspore tetrad and cells of sporogenous tissue idile edu diploid edu haploid nu ketirukanga parunga edu diploid microspore microspores vandu haploid sporogenous tissue diploid so the correct option edun pathina kuda option c In question number 29 parunga each of the sporogenous tissue acts on sporogenous over sporogenous tissue enna act panudhu abdin pathina ku vandu microspore mother cell la act panudhu nu solra microspore kedaiyadhu megaspore kedaiyadhu pollen grain kedaiyadhu each cell of sporogenous tissue act on microspore mother cell so correct option is d question number 30 parunga Microsporogenesis is a process in which Microsporogenesis Microsporosis are formed from tapetum cells No Microsporosis are formed from cells of middle layers of microsporangium No Microsporosis are formed from pollen mother cells Yes, correct option So, question number 30 is correct option is C Next, question number 31 on maturity anther dash and the pollen grain develops from microspores on maturity anther enna avade hydrate agada desiccate agada dehydrate agada become hard dehydrate agade mature anther on maturity anther vand dehydrate alagara water remove aayi enna form agadana pollen grains pollen grains develops into microspores dinner so the correct option edanaka c 32 for me male gametophyte is represented by microspore mother cell pollen grain vegetative cell none of these so the male gametophyte on the act on the green pathina come on the is pollen grain 
pollen grain the male gametophyte. Then question number 33 Pollen grains are generally spherical with diameter of pollen grains are spherical diameter. See all the micrometers could the diameter 25 to 50 micrometers. Patella centimeter lurk. Illame on the micros. Microscope leather number pack on the other micro. So correct option B. Question number 34 parne. The outer layer of pollen is made up of outer layer made up of sporopollenin. Outer layer is made up of sporopollenin. Inner layer is pectin and cellulose. So pollen grain or outer layer in our case sporopollenin. Option D. Question number 35 parne. Pollen. The exine has sporopollenin present. Sorry, okay. In two layers, in one layer throughout the pollen, in one layer but absent at a small apertures. Yes, option C is correct. Uh, the, the pollen grain la pathina like small pores circle and the edit on the sporopollen in where the small apertures are present on pollen grain, the sporopollen is absent. So correct option C. In question number 36 for the inner layer of pollen is made up of. So, inner layer is made up of outer layer is made up of uh, sporopollenin, inner layer is made up of cellulose and pectin. So, option D. Question number 37 parne. Mature pollen grain contains how many cells? Mature pollen grain contains there are two cells. In 60% of plants, pollen grain contains two cells. In the remaining 40% of plants, pollen grain contains three cells. So majority of plant species are on the two cell stage level. So correct option is A. Next, the vegetative cell of mature pollen grain is what is number two? Vegetative cell of mature pollen grain. Right. Vegetative cell of mature pollen grain has large irregularly shaped nucleus circle. So option C is the correct answer. Next, question number thirty-nine. Parne. Which of the following cell is small, spindle shaped with dense cytoplasm? In Patina Kondi, spindle shaped like the Patina generative cell. Generative cell, the spindle shaped like the dense cytoplasm. So, option B, B is the correct answer. Then, question number 40 parne, the ploidy of generative cell and vegetative cell, respectively. Ploidy of vegetative cell, generative cell, first one is generative cell cater kanga. Haploid. Generative cell haploid. Da. Vegetative cell haploid. Da. So the correct option is B. Question number 41. In 60% of angiosperm pollen grain shed that air can even brisk us by 60% of angiosperm from the two-celled stage. The remaining 40% on the three-celled stage. Abdin so correct option B. Question number 42. Parne. Some plant species pollen shed that three-celled stage. Which cell divides and by the division to transform into three cell stage of pollen grain? Abdin Ketraka. In the cell divide of the vegetative cell, generative cell, Abdin Padina, generative cell the on the further divide I, the two male gametes of form Pono. It undergoes mitosis cell division. So, correct option C. Then, question number 43 Parne, the common name of carrot grass is common name of carrot grass in a Sudan Abdin Padina, anti rhinum kadea, the viola kadea, the oriza sativa kadea. Parthenium is the correct option. Option D, common name of character is another Parthenium. Next, 44. Parthenium plant introduced in India as a containment with the imported wheat is responsible for which disease? Any disease in the Parthenium plant. Parthenium plant is an allergy. allergy Especially when the breathing related problems are caused. Okay, so correct option in a B. Question number 45. Pollen grains adversely affect which system of the body? Just now I said the inner system affect the excretory, central nervous system, circulatory system of the respiratory system affect the answer in option D. Pollen grains in the part affect the respiratory system. Question number 46. Incorrect statement get the incorrect statement either have been padina con the outer thin layer of pollen grain is made up of sporopollenin. In the outer on the thick layer sporopollenin. So the F A on the incorrect. The next the inner layer of pollen pollen is called as integment. No, the ovule is integment. 
So, B U incorrect statement. C for the pollen grain rich in nutrients. Yes, correct. Tablets, food supplements are used for the pollen consumption is claimed to increase performance. Athletes and race are skilled. C and D correct. So, incorrect A and B. So, correct option D. So, question number 47 for To bring about fertilization, pollen grains have to land on which floral part before losing viability? Sorry. In the part mele the land agno of dinner the alarm tenya. Stigma melada land agno. Petals melio, thalamus melio, calyx melio, land on a yendu use and kade. Na pollen enga land agno, stigma mele. So correct option C. Question number 48 parne. In which of the following plants pollen does not remain viable for a day? In the plant or a pollen green or nal could have viable arcade. Of din pathing in a conde rosa, pea, vita, potato, wheat plant. The wheat plant is just 30 minutes of viable. So, the correct option is C. 49. Pollen grain of rice are viable up to rice plant or pollen grain is viable. Only 30 minutes. Just now I said 30 minutes are viable. Okay. So, the correct option is D. The last question is in the quiz. Pollen grain can be stored for years in. Pollen grain is stored for the liquid use for the cesium chloride, biotechnology use for the liquid nitrogen. Yes, sperm and pollen grain preserve the liquid nitrogen, chlorine use for the So, correct option is B, liquid nitrogen. Thank you very much for listening our videos. Those so, watching our videos, you are requested to like, subscribe, and share to your friends. All the best. This is Pollen number quiz programs on the discuss panaporo. So Adanala on the those who are watching our videos, you are requested to continuously uh, continuously see our uh, videos.